Valerie Lavov, world champion, light welterweight classification, won it at Belgrade last year. Tough, another of the tall, straight-up Soviet fighters, long-armed, long-legged, with superb upper-body strength. His opponent, Young Lem Steeples, the man who was converted, who was a southpaw, converted back and is back to a southpaw again, as you see him with the right lead. In the first round, Steeples surprised. He fought very cleverly. Notice the way he's using the ring and the quickness of his hands, the quickness of that right moving forward in jab-like fashion. His task is to stay out of range of the more powerful and more experienced Lavoie, who is, after all, 26 years of age. In the first round, Steeples did it. And Lavoie is unquestionably having trouble with the southpaw stance. Ed Urbeck cautions Steeples about the use of the head. Ed Urbeck, third man in the ring in Shrewsbury, Massachusetts. There are two Soviet judges scoring, one American judge in this bout. 20-point must system, three three-minute rounds. This is Olympic-style boxing. And while this fight has not been action-packed, I think that was a caution. Oh, a good left by Steeples hurt Lavov. I believe that last quick stop was a caution to the Soviet in the corner not to coach their fighter during the fight. That's my judgment of what that quick call was. No question Lavov was stung. No question Lavov was stung by a Steeples right there. Lem Steeples fighting surprisingly well against the world champion in the light welterweight classification. He has taken the lead in this fight in terms of making the fight. And he is fighting it the way he wants to fight it. He has not let the tallest Soviet fighter measure him. He has not let him take advantage of the longer arms. Right there, Lavov with a wild miss. That's hardly impressive to Olympic officials. It's surprising what Steeples is doing. In the quick hands. Second round action as we approach the end of the round. Back. Back. Smallish fellow, light welterweight, born in St. Louis, lives in St. Louis, boxes out of the Southside Boxing Club in St. Louis. But what a show he's put on for the first two rounds against that man. Valerie Lava, the world champion, light welterweight classification at Belgrade, Yugoslavia a year ago. Steeples, a southpaw, using that quick-handed right, has been, by my precepts, the dominant fighter in this fight. It has the makings of a big, big upset. Good left again there by Steeples. He has forced the fighter. He has made his kind of fight. The long-armed Soviet fighter has not been able to score. Not up till now, anyway. That's Ed Urbeck of Shrewsbury, Massachusetts. Repeat, two Soviet judges, one American judge in this one. That always leaves room for doubt. Room for Good left lead by Steeples. And then a short right follow-up. And Steeples again. And Lavov a little bit hurt. This kid is putting on a great show. Again, the left. He mixes up those leads. By the way, Steeples almost went down. Right there. He got hit with the left. The knees buckled. So it's back and forth in a good action fight. Lavov from nowhere scoring. Short left. Overall, this has been Steeples. However, we'll have to watch the score closely. 
redness around Lvov's nose. Remember, Lvov, the world champion, light welterweight classification. There's a blood coming out of the left corner of Lvov's mouth. Steeples fighting a beautifully intelligent fight, mixing up the right and the left lead, fighting out of the southpaw stance, which has troubled Lvov all the way. And on his toes, moving nicely. You see him bouncing. Now going down to the stomach. Diversified attack by the young man. Very clever fight. Less than a minute to go. We're going to stay for the decision. Again, he scores. Well, I've been through so many of these competitions. So many decisions. He's claiming a low blow. Lvov is claiming a low blow, and Urbeck says no. Lvov claimed he was hurt, held his stomach, cried low blow. 30 seconds left. Well, no matter whom they give the decision to, Steeples is showing that he's quite capable of going against the best in the world in Olympic or international competition. A good fight by Steeples. Stung Lvov. Lvov's guard coming down. The left, not up there, guarding the face as much as it was. That's why that right is getting in there. Good fight. There it is. The decision. Referee Ed Urbeck in the middle. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner from the USSR, Valerie Lvov.